Hello, I'm David Azer, and this is 3 Minute Ad Age, your daily video news show. Today we take a look at a new frontier in the street-level advertising business, store windows that have become the new billboards. One reason is that shop operators like the idea of turning their underused windows into revenue generators. Another is the emerging technology that supports the creation of three-dimensional video and animation effects in such large window spaces. Dramatic examples of in-window advertising, also known as storescapes, can now be found throughout major metro areas from New York to L.A. New York-based in-window outdoor is one of the more active companies selling storescapes. President Steve Bernhack says he stumbled upon the idea in 2002. I've been walking by um, a building on 23rd Street and I saw a window that had a display for G.I. Joe and I didn't see any toy store so I went up to the doorman and asked what the story was and he said, oh, uh, Mattel or Hasbro has their offices upstairs and that's why uh, you see this display case. So sort of set off a light bulb in my head and, and I thought, wow, there are lots of vacant retail windows all over the city that could be used um, for marketing purposes. And what kind of metrics does this new medium use to quantify its bypasser audience? We have it's resources from our landlords, for example, that tell us the breakdown of, of who's walking by the space, who lives in the neighborhood and so forth. Um, we get traffic counts from the business improvement districts. So we have a pretty good idea of how many people are walking by the spaces. Partnering with the digital creative agency Monster Media, InWindow took their static vinyl ad wraps digital and then interactive. A recent Midtown Manhattan campaign for the financial company iShares created the illusion of an actual three-dimensional office inside a window. Playing with the tagline, Clear the Financial Fog, the display used motion sensors to disperse a layer of fog as people passed. Another campaign for the BBC offered a Bluetooth video download of a clip from the film Robin Hood. In window managing partner Jeffrey Cohen says the placement and interactivity of the displays is what makes them so compelling. It's really the largest medium you can buy that's a contiguous image at street level. And so it's inherently impactful when you see it. And once you add an interactive component to that, of course, that just takes it to the next level. You could stop. You're guaranteed to engage the ad. Uh, you can manipulate what's happening with the ad. And it adds a sense of empowerment to a passing pedestrian. And I think um, when you put those two together, it's pretty powerful. And that's it for this three-minute ad age. Thanks for being with us. I'm David Azer at Advertising Age in New York.